What's up, family? Man, before I get started, man, I bless each and every one of you, man, that watched this video. Man, may God source universe. And may they get your attention. You know, may they get your attention and help you understand that you have to grow the fuck up. You know what I mean? You've got to stop playing fucking games. You're not kidding anybody but yourself. You're deceiving yourself, nobody else. When it really comes down to it. Here we go. And this is gonna be rough for some of you to hear. Because some people think they woke. Some people think, man, I've grown up and I did that, 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 that. And in the reality, they ain't done shit. You know what I mean? They ain't done shit. Truth be told. You know what I mean? And, it's, and again, we live in a generation where everybody wants to appear to be so freaking deep. Everybody wants to appear to be so much smarter, so much wiser than what they really are. And they can't handle somebody being deeper than them. They can't handle somebody being wiser than them. They can't handle somebody being smarter than them, somebody being more experienced than them. They can't handle that shit. It sets them off because their ego has them so fucked up. Anytime they meet somebody like that, man, it makes them feel like I'm not good enough. It makes them feel like I'm stupid. I'm not stupid, I'm not dumb. Man. Ain't nobody said all that. Ain't nobody said you were stupid and dumb and ignorant. Da, da, da. It just said you need to grow the fuck up. But because of our ego and our ego having us so fucked up, we think we're so much smarter than what we really are. We think we're so much more advanced than what we really are. Source, universe, God has a way of testing your ass to show you right where you at. We don't want to accept that though. We don't want to believe that though. We don't want to see that though. Because that shatters our ego. That shatters our perception of how deep and how woke we really are. This is why the great majority of us don't want to do shadow work. This is why the great majority of us don't want to look in the mirror. This is why the great majority of us don't like real motherfuckers that's put in that fucking work. Because real motherfuckers that's put in that motherfucking word, when you look at them, when you get in their fucking vicinity, you get in their fucking presence, you know, without a shadow of a doubt, that you ain't shit. And what I mean by that, you ain't done the motherfucking work. You can't hide the fact that you ain't done the fucking work to somebody who's been there, done that shit. You can't hide the fact that you ain't put in the motherfucking work in the presence of somebody who's put in the fucking work. Their light fucks up your darkness, that light shines in your fucking ignorance. Their light illuminates your fucking darkness. Their, li their light, the real ones, the chosen ones, the ones that put in that motherfucking work, the ones that have healed and grew the fuck up, their light, their presence, their energy, their aura illuminates the fact that you ain't put in that motherfucking work. It shines on your fucking darkness. It shines on your fucking ignorance. And you know it. And that's why you try to tell them now. That's why you come after them so fucking hard. Oh, you ain't all that. Da, 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 da. These motherfuckers ain't even thinking about you. But you quit to try to attack them. They're standing there trying to share some knowledge and wisdom and understanding. And you can't fucking accept it because your the lack of light within you has been made known to you and everybody around you. And you can't handle that. Now your ego's fucking with you. Now you go into defense mode. Now you go into attack mode. Man, I gotta attack these motherfuckers. Who the fuck he is? Telling women. Da, 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 da. He could talk about these sorry ass dudes all day long. But as soon as he starts saying something about fucking females and how sorry these fucking females are raggedy and wretched and loud and obnoxious and annoying these fucking females have gotten, we gotta shut his motherfucking ass down. And we gotta attack his motherfucking monkey ass. And da, da, da. We get all fucked up in our fucking energy and our fucking ego when a real one shows up. When a real one speaks, it fucks with you. It fucks with you. 
And here's the trip. It fucks with you for two reasons. Not for two reasons, excuse me. It fucks with you and two things happen. You resonate with it and it's like, damn, I feel that shit. Damn, I was just thinking that. Damn, something was telling me that and, and I wasn't trying to hear it and what to do. Damn, God, Source Universe just shared that with me. I just saw something about this last night. I just saw something about this this morning. I was just having a conversation about that. Damn, okay, I need to really look at this. Damn, I need, I need to really pay attention to this. I accept that light. I accept that knowledge, that wisdom, that energy. I accept that. That's confirmation from God, source universe, for me to grow the fuck up. That's confirmation from God, source universe, that, man, I'm on the right page. I'm on the right place. That's one way some of us look at it. The other way, a lot of you look at it, you get defensive. You get triggered. Not understand that God, source, universe, most high, is sending that person to share that knowledge, wisdom, understanding with you, their energy with you, to help you understand that you're being triggered, to help you understand you're being pissed off, to show you all the fucking work you got to do. Still. To show you where you're not. Catch that. We get triggered or we get excited because, man, I feel that, I resonate with that. And, man, God, source the user numbers is sending this person to help me. Da, 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 da. Or we get pissed the fuck off and we go into attack mode and shut down mode. And do we check that fucking cancel culture? We try to shut that person's light off. We try to cancel that motherfucker, get rid of that motherfucker, start attacking that motherfucker because their fucking light, their energy, their presence is fucking up our fucking frequency. It's showing us how fucked up we really are. And we don't want to accept it. Everybody ain't ready to grow up. Everybody don't want to grow up. A lot of these motherfuckers belong to the fucking streets. And you got to leave their fucking ass alone. It is what it is. It's like somebody who's a full-blown out on um, drug addict. You can't rescue them. You can't help a full-blown drug addict. You can have all the fucking interventions you want to. You're not going to rescue that motherfucker until that motherfucker get to a place in their life, in their time, in their mind of, man, I'm sick and tired of being the bullshit. I'm sick and tired of dumpster diving. I'm sick and tired of sucking dick and selling my ass and whoop doo doo to get my next fix and da 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 Man, I gotta, something's gotta change. Until that person gets to that place in their life, they're not going to change. I don't give two fucks how much you pray for them. I don't give two fucks how much you try to do for them. They're not gonna change. Until they're ready to change. Until they've crashed and burned enough. It's no difference with anybody else. It's no different from anybody else. Nobody's going to change until they get to a place in their life. Man, I'm, I'm sick and tired of the bullshit. I can't keep faking the funk anymore. I can't keep lying to myself anymore. I can't keep lying to humanity anymore. I can't keep lying to my family anymore. Man, I, I'm fucked up. I'm da -da 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 da 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 And we got to start telling the fucking truth. But until you get to that place of being sick and tired of, man, I'm done. I'm done. I'm not doing this shit no more. I'm not going through this shit no fucking more. Until you get to that place. You're not really serious about your growth and development. You can talk the talk all you fucking want to. You can make fucking videos all you fucking want to. Until you get to that place. You're not serious. You're not serious. And it is what it is. I, I understand that we're all at different places and different levels of growth and development. We're all at different stages. 
in our growth and development. The problem isn't that we're at different levels in our growth and development. The problem is that the great majority of motherfuckers ain't put in the fucking work and want to be treated as though these motherfuckers got 25, 30 years up under their belt of growth and development. And these motherfuckers just got on the fucking scene. These motherfuckers ain't put six months of growth and development in. And now they want to act and talk as though they've been doing this shit for fucking decades. It is what it is. You know what I mean? You got to be desperate for your growth and development. You got to be fucking hungry for this shit. You got to be hungry for change. You got to be desperate for change. You got to get to the place of, I don't give a fuck what anybody talking about. I don't give a fuck what my family talking about. I don't give a fuck what this dude talking about. I don't give a fuck what this woman talking about. I don't give a fuck what my kids talking about. I got to change my motherfucking life. I ain't got time to sit here and go through another fucked up relationship. I ain't got time to go through another fucking devastating situation like this again. I ain't got time to lose my fucking mind like this again. I ain't got time to slam dope no more. I ain't got time to fuck with the bottles no more. I ain't got time to pop these fucking pills anymore. I ain't got time to chase this fucking pussy anymore. I ain't got time to chase this dick anymore. I'm sick and tired of the bullshit. And all I want to do is sit my ass down and have some fucking peace. I just want to sit my ass down and have some fucking joy. I'm tired of stressing the fuck out. I'm tired of being worried about everybody fucking else. I'm tired of being stressed and angry and depressed. I'm tired. Until you get to that point, you're not really serious about your fucking growth and development. You're not. You watch all the videos you want to. You read all the books you want to. You're not really serious. You gotta have that breakdown moment. You have to have that breakdown moment. Or you feel like you just lost your motherfucking mind. Where you feel like I'm having a nervous breakdown. I'm losing my fucking noodles. I'm losing my fucking mind. What the fuck is going on? You're having an awakening moment. Doesn't mean that you fucking woke. Doesn't mean you're fucking enlightened. It doesn't mean you're fucking all knowing at that point. You're coming into the awareness that change has to happen. You're coming into the awareness that I've been doing this shit wrong. You've coming into the, the awareness that my fucked up perspective had me fucked up. And I gotta change. I gotta change how I see the world. I gotta change how I react to situations. got to grow up. The question is, are you serious about your growth and development? I hope and pray that I said something to encourage you, to inspire you, to even challenge your way of thinking. We have to grow up, family. This is not a fucking game. I love you guys. Happy healing. Peace.